Hey there, fine people. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm just going to give a quick review of what's on my wish list. And I'm going to try to narrow it down to two or three polishes. And I'm probably going to get two stamping plates. So, uh, top on my list is Cuticula Extraterrestrial. And I am a sucker for green polish with a orange copper glow. This is that. I'll have to look to see how close it is to NB Lacquer's Fire Swamp that I already have. But as of right now, this is at the top of my list. What is there to say? It's gorgeous. It's got large particle shimmer. It's got orange, it's got green, it's got everything that I'm a fan of. The shimmer is so strong on this, I, I just, look at that. It's got flakies, and it looks great matte. I'm loving it. Next is Zombie Call zombie claws space gray zombies and this is gray with a green shimmer let's read the description a space gray base loaded with electric blue green shimmer and hollow flakies i just like it i like gray i like a gray with a shimmer and this is really pretty the pictures are gorgeous macro shots man yeah i just really want this Dark and Twisted Lacquer, A Cosmic View. This is a navy base with red, orange, larger particle shimmer, tiny silver hollow micros, and some small silver hollow dots. So those first two were almost 100% that I'm going to get. This one I'm on the fence on, but I do love it. There's a theme here with that orange shimmer. I don't love the large dot glitters in this, but I think they could easily be bypassed, left off the nail. Another contender, but probably won't buy, is ne uh, NB Lacquer's Nebula Garden. It's not that I don't think it's beautiful, just I have to limit my purchases, and this one I'm not 100% on. It's beautiful. I love those black flakies in there. It's got a lot of shiftiness. I might talk myself into it. This, These um, Envy Lacquer and Dark and Twisted Lack, those are strong wants for me. The rest of these are, I would like, but they're not absolutely necessary. Femme Fatale, Eldritch Dream World, and they only have one picture. It's beautiful. Inspired by Lovecraft's Color of out, color out of Space. A soft mint green jelly base with prominent blue glow, filled with silver, silver holographic glitters in our classic assorted mix. Same as our Astral Charms, Cinder Jewel, etc. Plus a smattering of eerie green reflective glitters. I really like this. It's very summery and I... Summery, springy, and I really feel like I could use more of those type of polishes. Being drawn to the dark green ones all the time. I need some variety. So this is a contender. Next, Jour Couture and Sassy Sauce are very similar. Um, the Jour Couture is a thermal. The Sassy Sauce is not. I would probably lean more towards the Sassy Sauce because of that. The Jour Couture has a little bit of, in the cold state, it's more purple than I would prefer. So, and the sassy sauce is cheaper. So that would if I were going to get this one, I would probably 
get something like this. It would probably be this one. A smoky base filled with glowy red copper shimmer and a blue black shifting UCC flakes. I don't know what UCC is. Ultra Chameleon? I'm not sure. Let me know in the comments. It can be used as a topper or built up in two to three coats. Now, I, to my eye, I'm seeing a lot of purple in the shift. So that's deterring me a little bit. So this is just a maybe. There's a strong orange glow, though. Look at that. Mm, love it. A pain in the asteroid. And finally, glistening glow, Omega Centauri. This is inspired by a globular cluster in the constellation of Centaurus that was first identified as a non-stellar object by Edmund Halley in 1677. It is the largest known cluster in the Milky Way. It is estimated to contain 10 million stars. I love that she included that information. It's a black cherry polish with brown undertones and added hollow flakes and a star cluster of gold shimmer. This is a beautiful brown polish. I may have something similar in my collection already. I'll have to check. But it's quite beautiful. Looking good on a variety of skin tones. That is just a, a maybe buy. Did I miss any? Top coats and stamping plates. There's not much to say about that. Either you like the image or you like the top coat. So I'm not going to cover those. I don't want to waste your time. So what do you think? What's on your wish list? Let me know down in the comments. I'm always excited to hear what other people are considering getting before the uh, shopping begins. Last month, uh, one of the polishes that I was really interested in sold out uh, before midday on the day the shop opened. So I'll probably try and get, uh, get my order in early. Let me know what you think down in the comments. And as always, thanks for watching and have a great day.